I am going to see how fast I can go from 0 to 1 million in Retail Tycoon 2. Let's find out. Let's first make a brand new store and let's choose a plot for it. Now that we have the store, I'm going to quickly change the color. And now let's get rid of stuff we don't need so we can get some of our money back. I got rid of some walls and I replaced them with something cheaper. And I also replaced the grass with dirt to get some money back. Now we just made over $17,000. I'm going to be selling furniture in my store and for that I'm going to need a bigger truck. So I got in my car and I went to the dealership. The car I'm driving right now can only hold 3 pieces of furniture which is not a lot. Now that I'm at the dealership, I'm going to buy this van. It can carry 11 pieces of small furniture. It cost me $10,000, but that's okay since we're going to be making that money back. Now I'm going to go to the loading dock and pick up some furniture. For now, I'm only going to buy 15. Now let's go back to the store. I unloaded my truck, and since my store was all empty, I needed to put some shelves in it. I put some furniture shelves, two finance desks, some more parking, and some storage. Now all I had to do was stock the store up and I was all set to go. Now I can finally open my store. I forgot about the cash register so I quickly put one in. Just like that. And now we can open the store. Let's see how this works. After some time, I decided to hire a truck driver. I also ordered some more furniture. Somehow I also forgot to give the guy a truck so I gave him one. Later on I saw some robbers and I arrested them. They gave me some weird flashbacks. I saved up 4k and decided to buy some metal detectors just in case. I had a bad decoration level so I decided to wait until I have enough money for a water fountain. I bought the water fountain and I also hired a guard. I needed a security camera too so I waited until I had enough money. I bought some more furniture and realized my store was getting messy. So I decided to hire a janitor. I also placed a garbage bin for them. It's been some time now and I'm so close to hitting $100,000. My. My. And I did it. Now that we made our first 100k. <coughs> I, I destroyed the entire store. Because in this video I will rebuild the store every time I hit these amounts of money. I built a brand new store. I added some decoration. And I also stocked the shelves. Now it's time to open the store. I quickly added lights since I forgot and now the customers were flowing in. And guys, I just made a new Discord server, link in the description and make sure to subscribe. Let's get back to it. After 10 minutes, I realized that I didn't even have a loading dock, so I added one. That's probably why my shelves were not stocked for so long, but now I'm all good. I waited and I checked how long I spent in this game. It's almost been 3 hours and I think we're on track. I decided to save up for a bigger truck, so I waited for a little. Now that I have enough money, I got in my car and went to the dealership. I was choosing which truck to buy and bought this fast one, which can carry up to 31 pieces of furniture. I got into my truck and went back so I could give it to my worker. Now he can bring much more stuff. Later on, I got to 100k again. So then, I bought some more parking. I also bought a much better sign. I also got some more storage too. I waited for 2 hours and I got $250,000. Since I hit a major milestone again, I destroyed the whole store and rebuilt it into a much better one. Some people refused to leave and were complaining about cash registers, so I had to quickly deal with them. Now that my plot is nice and empty, it's time to build a much bigger store. My store looked very nice and big, and since it's big, I hired some more workers. I also forgot about garbage bins, so I had to quickly put them. I opened my store, 
and I bought a much bigger sign. And I spent most of my money on buying more furniture. Now I could sit back and relax. I saw a reflection of myself in the glass for some reason, but I didn't worry too much about it. And then I saw that guy again, and he was watching what my workers were doing, so I knew exactly what I needed to do. I trapped him, and he looked flabbergasted, and just started laying down. I didn't really know who that guy was, so I just kept relaxing. After waiting so long, I finally hit 500k. I was very excited that I was halfway done, so I destroyed my whole entire store and built a much bigger and better one. I opened my store and it was time for business. I've spent almost 8 hours doing this now. And now that I had a store that would make me a million dollars, I could sit back and relax and wait. I decorated the store a little bit and I started relaxing again. It's been 4 hours and I'm finally so close to my goal. With one more sale. Come on. Come on. Come on. I finally reached $1 million. After I was done being excited, I closed my store and waited for it to become empty. And now that it's empty, I'm going to build the best store I ever did with $1 million. I bought some more land and I got to work. And finally, I was complete. I went to the dealership and bought the biggest truck which can carry 75 pieces of furniture. I gave it to my worker and went back to my store. So how long did it take? In total, it took 10 hours and 58 minutes, which sounds pretty good. It took a very long time, so make sure to subscribe and join the Discord server I just created. Link in description.